Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a real quick tutorial for you, another micro tutorial on using the guides in uh, Clip Studio Paint. And here I have um, set up, this is my, uh, my thumbnail that I've blown up to a page size that I'm gonna, <coughs> excuse me, prepare to, uh, to start penciling. And uh, before I do that, I like to lay out the panels first. And um, I come over here, and you're going to find the um, the guides under the rulers, where we found the perspective ruler in the last tutorial. And here's the guide right above it. Now, uh, what I use guides for is to, um, when I want my panels to line up, I just lay them out like that and basically you're just touching uh, touching the page um, and dragging in which direction you want to go with your guide and it will automatically set up um, perfectly straight horizontal or vertical guides. Um, let me undo that one. If you, like I said, uh, I just undo. I ugh, excuse me. I undid that one, and because it wasn't perfect, so I want the line to be more there. So, yeah. If you make a mistake, just undo it and redo it again. And the guides uh, show up on their own panel here, and it's active as soon as you set the guide. So when I want to lay out my panels, I'm gonna click on my panel layer. And then go over here and grab my uh, rectangle, and you'll see that um, the panels are going to snap to these guides. Whoops! And sometimes if you're too close, they're going to want to snap to multiple guides, which is a problem. So probably what I'm going to do here is go ahead and lay out these two panels, then um, if you ever want to delete a guide, you can go make sure your guide layer is active, click on it, and you will get that little um, diamond shape to know that it's active. And then you can just hit delete and it's gone. So now I'm going to go back here to panels and lay out my final panel. Whoop whoop. And you'll notice we no longer have that unsightly sticking thing happening. And there we go. And all my panels are laid out nice and tight like I want them. So that is how I use the guides. Because I don't use... The <laughs> uh, Clip Studio Paint actually has a, a paneling tool. But I don't use it because I just got used to doing things this way. Uh, because my old computer couldn't handle the um, <clears throat> the processing power that was needed to do the the panel layout thing. Now that I have a new computer, I could probably switch, but this works for me, and I'm still just as fast. So, eh, you know, you'll do what you uh, feel most comfortable with. Anyway, so that's pretty much it for this tutorial. Uh, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and leave any comments you have down in the comment box. Ask me any questions. Feel free. And don't forget that I have a webcomic, findsometimesrain.gankygirl.com, if you want to give it a check out. And I'm also on social media. I'm pretty much at Tsukiono everywhere. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.